Don't you throw your handkerchief at me, Tony. Tony, don't throw it at me, Tony. Don't throw it at me, Tony. Tony, Tony, Tony. Welcome back, guys, to Fog Entertainment, and we are looking at The Sopranos, episode two of season three, and we're looking at Livia Soprano, of course. We're looking at what if Livia never died. Now, of course, there is other circumstances at play here, because for the simple reason is with this it wasn't just a case of Livia dying it was actually the actress Nancy M Merriman I believe something, something along those lines she um, sadly passed away guys so we, we can't really say here oh well, why did they kill her off that's why they killed her off so for the sake of this video we are talking about what if the actress didn't die and what if um, Livia didn't die of course they were going to be going with the tech the, the store the, the, the whole bloody yeah uh, the gimmick of the bloody air yeah, yeah, yeah airplane tickets but as we said in the review for episode two i i, I am actually glad that we didn't go down the route of that storyline for me that was just boring and i think if i think it just affected the whole storyline of early season three like episode one's literally just installing a lamp into <laughs> into the premises of tony's house that's literally what it is episode two Olivia dies, we get introduced to like Ralph, I guess, and and then we have her funeral, and then everyone kind of just speaks a bit of shit about her, I mean, there's nothing really spectacular about it, and I'm just kind of glad that we don't get to see Livia's character a lot more, do not get it to see fleshed out or whatever, it's done, Tony, she's buried, Tony's watching that movie at the end, and, he, and a wee tear trickles down his face and he wipes it clean he's like god damn it why am i crying over the worst character in tv history well i'm not too sure tony why you're crying over the worst character in tv history but at the end of the day you are and that's what we're here to discuss and break down in today's video and what if she didn't die well i think they would have went with this whole airline ticket thing which of course tony gave to her in like a fit of rage which i think was going to be like a big plot point of the early uh of like early season three like, was she going to testify? Was, was that the way they were going to bring Tony down? But, like, realistically, I don't think it would have mattered. Would, would Tony have really spent any time in jail? Would he have got arrested? I just don't see it ever happening, to be honest. I think it would have just been more dragged out garbage. And he probably would have just held a bit more resentment towards Junior. So, to be honest, guys, I'm actually glad this is the way they went doing and not any other way. For me, this would have just been... I think it just would have sucked. Keeping Livia alive, this whole airplane storyline. I, I prefer what they did in season three, to be honest, trips. So that's where we're going to leave you. I just don't see what else really would have happened. Like, we love talking about fairy feds with most TV shows that we do here on YouTube, but season three is not exactly kicked off strong in that department. Like, what is there really to say about Livia here if she didn't die? They would have they, they would have went for an airplane ticket storyline that, like, realistically, no one cares about. And realistically, Tony wouldn't have done any jail time for. Could it have affected his crew? Could it affect it Silvio, Polly, Chris? I was going to say Big Sal. Big Sal's deed. Forget about Big Sal. Big Sal is deed, guys. But anyway, that's what would have happened. Nothing would have happened. Livia, you old bastard.